The United Nations has said that the humanitarian crisis in the internally displaced persons IDP's camps in Benue State is worse than those in the northeastern part of Nigeria, particularly in Bonu State. The humanitarian coordinator in Nigeria, Dr. Matthias Schmel, made the observation when he visited some of the IDP camps in company of the governor and his team. Our correspondent Francis Thier reports that Schmel urged Governor Alaya to identify key issues in order to find solutions to the insecurity crisis bedeviling the state, adding that the UN is keen to work with governments who are willing to bring lasting solutions. Governor Alaya, on his part, decried the extent of humanitarian crisis his administration, on assumption of office, has encountered. It is very devastating to witness this man's inhumanity to man. The camp we have here, by the records, we have over 14,000 uh, members in here. But this was an unofficial uh, camp. So you, it's better imagined the other camps that we have that are yet to be discovered with the presence of the United Nations. Uh, I understand fully well that the resources of the state uh, could not uh, cushion an inch of the burden from all these camps. So their presence and their open arms and compassionate heart is going to make a difference. I am quite touched by the number of the things that are missing if in this uh, unofficial camp. There's no water. Uh, there, there are no uh, toilet facilities. Uh, so it's like just sitting on a time bomb. So, but the good news is going to be that um, uh, in a number of days, we are going to uh, put measures in place. So the first thing to say is I have seen IDPs and IDP camps all over the world. What I have seen here today is amongst the worst situations I've seen, yeah? including compared to other places in Nigeria like the Northeast. So really, this, this can leave no one untouched to see 14,000 people, as we're told, in these kinds of miserable conditions, as the governor has already said, no access to safe water, no education. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.